You're watching WMAR 2 News. I'm Jamie Costello. These are your WMAR 2 News top stories. Damage done and an ATM gone at an Essex Exxon. This is what the store on Back River Neck Road it looked like as crews repair the hole that thieves made in the store. Happened around 1.45 this morning with the thieves busting open to get a small amount of cash before driving off in a stolen car. Baltimore County detectives say stores should reach out to them on how to protect their stores from thieves before they're hit. Our community outreach team will do security assessments. They will go to local businesses, they will survey the area, they will see necessarily, hey, you may want to put surveillance cameras here, you may want to secure this door here. Hey, you have an ATM that is located in the front of your store, you should probably think about moving it to the rear of the store because it's less desirable for criminals to attempt to steal. No one was injured in the smash and grab in Essex. Rain showers wrap up overnight and we'll get a short break from the rain before it makes a return heading into the weekend. So keep that umbrella nearby. Temperatures tonight in the upper 40s. Showers wrap up as we go through the seven day forecast. It's mostly dry Thursday under partly cloudy skies. Friday looks like an all day rain. We're talking early in the morning through the evening hours. Light showers in place. Lingering thunder showers into Saturday. High temperatures get back to that 70 degree mark and then some. Staying active early next week, but a break from this active pattern Tuesday, Wednesday, and a partly cloudy skies. Click with us online at WMAR2news.com all day for updates on top stories and breaking news. Also, for news and weather while you're on the go, download the WMAR2news app in the App Store. Thanks for watching. I'm Jamie Costello.